today's video is not geared for the fun, not necessarily, it is more on a serious matter. Today I'm discussing the fact that there is obviously lots of trouble, I'm sure you already know, lots of trouble in Ukraine right now. There's a huge war happening right now between Ukraine and Russia, and today I am making a video dedicated towards this situation. I have decided to take part into the hashtag creators for peace uh, program and donate money towards this program who is using this money to help fund for these uh, Ukrainians who have lost their homes. Some of them have lost family members and friends. You can help out as well by clicking the link in the description and help donate the best that you can. If you can't donate, that's fine. Just share this video, or more importantly, share the link with friends and family who possibly can donate and support this really tough situation for the Ukrainians. Not only am I donating to this program, but also I am making a Minecraft video, specifically the this map that I found. And this map is the capital of Ukraine, all in Minecraft. So I want to explore it, check it out, and see the beautiful uh, city that it is. Okay, so what I want to do, actually, uh, number one, I put shaders on because I want this place to look absolutely amazing. Honestly, I don't care if it gets laggy. This is for Ukraine, boys. This is actually pretty cool um, because you can see it is in Ukraine. Um, so the person who made this is Ukrainian, uh, apparently. Uh, it says minimum distance to draw 30 recommended is 50 insane. Well, boys and girls, I think we're going to have to go extreme and... Uh, Let's make the render distance insane. Look, he's, he said 30. He or she, whoever made this, said 30 minimum. So let's do that. I'm going to let it load and talk about what I want to do. So basically, I want to go around here because this is based off the uh, place called... Let me actually double check here what it's called. Flip over. Okay. So it's called the Maiden. I have no idea how to pronounce that. No idea. Not even going to try. But basically, it's this really epic place, and apparently, it's it's got like a a mall here, and I want to see, go back and forth in Minecraft and see the difference and see how insane this builder was able to do, and basically, was were they able to make it to scale? Uh, obviously, not exact scale, but I want to see how well they actually did. So obviously, as you could see. I can't actually uh, read this, so I don't even know what they're talking about. Well, if you look over here, uh, yes, it's super laggy. I'm at 30 frames now, um, but we're at 30 for the render distance, which is absolutely amazing. I need to get all this stuff to load. Uh, but over here is, I don't even know what this is called. Um, let me double check. The Independence Monument is what it's called. And... It honestly looks insane. Let me drag a guy here. I actually saw this before I started the video. And I wanted to look and see how insane this is. And it looks absolutely amazing. If you take a look. Look at that. That looks fantastic. It's a glass here. Which actually, I want to check that out. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, there's, there's glass. There's glass right there. I wonder if I can... Yeah, I just go up. Can I go over here? No, it the X's won't let me. That sucks. But look at that. There we go. Just look at that. Look at this beast of a monument. It's called the Independence Monument. So this is when they broke free from Russia. I don't know about free, but I don't really know the whole story. But basically, they decided not to be you know, teamed up with Russia anymore and they decided to be their own country and no longer be in the hands of Russia and be by themselves and I'm guessing that's what that means the independence monument it's a historical monument and I'm guessing that's what that means so let me actually drag this one more time and see it compared to Minecraft so here it is in person it's got something up there I don't know what that is but it's gold it's got the white and let me take a look in Minecraft and see how accurate this is. 
take a look. Holy. That actually is very accurate. Bro, it's even got the glass. Now, I would have probably done a blue for the glass. Or something, because that's what the actual glass is. But still, they even put the detail in the glass. And we've got the gold on the sides here. The golden... I think it was a star on the actual one. No, it's not. It's... I don't even know what that is. Let me swap over. If you look here... I don't know what that is. Right there at the top. No idea what that is. It looks like a clam or something. But it does look absolutely insane. It's just pure gold at these the tips of these pillars. And whatever that is. Um, that's probably some type of symbol, I'm sure. Which is pretty cool. But if we go back into Minecraft and see this at the top here, I want to actually see how accurate the top is. I don't know what the top actually is. Maybe this will be a better visual of detail. Okay, so I don't really know what to call that other than a Y. Um, but it definitely, they took the detail to an extreme amount. Which is crazy. Even the bottom part. Holy. That looks insane. And then the bleachers. I think these are bleachers. I don't know what these are. But it's made of glass. But that's in the. That's actually a thing too. Oh, 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 oh. Look at that. It says Globus right there. Globus. That was in. It said something about that in the map. And then these are doors to go in. Can I actually go in? Holy. Oh my goodness, this is the whole map. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the whole map. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. Look at this thing. Okay, so here's where we're at right now. This is where we're at right now. And the whole map just looks insane altogether. It's got parking spots. It's got just an insane amount of detail. So here's, here's that. This is the other thing I wanted to check out. This is where the mall starts. I don't know if this is actually the mall itself or if it's just an area entering the mall. And I don't know what all these little buildings are. Detail is crazy. Absolutely insane. Like I said, sorry about the lag, but Ukraine deserves this. My PC dies. So what, bro? This is the, also the guy. Let me see what his name is. This is the guy just to give him some credit uh no idea i inserted the, my statue i was the founder of the minecraft kiev i i believe that's what's actually called this is the yeah that's that's this is insane okay let me check this out over here oh it's got the subways even it's even got the underground tunnels for the trains is this where the trains are Shopping center. Oh, shopping center Globus. So that's the name of the shopping center is Globus. And we've even got people here. Oh my goodness. We got the cash box. People at the cash register. Holy smokes. This place is insane. My goodness. Oh my. It just looks absolutely insane. But yeah, let me check these out because this is on the actual... This is real right here. So we got this big old dome that I guess I'm sure you can't actually hop over. But let me actually see this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I don't know what this is actually called. Independent Square. Okay. So it's called the Independence Square. And I can't actually go forward more, which sucks. But here we have the dome. And it looks like you would be able to go around it. And look at that. It's even got the bars. They even put the detail. The creator put the detail in Minecraft as well. If you go back and see, there's the detail of the the bars here as well. Which is really, really cool attention to detail. And then, of course, we have the lights as well. But let me keep actually looking at the real thing. The real thing looks so much more insane. See if I can walk around here. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Perfect. Oh, what the? What just happened? It's like a festival, bro. Oh my. Bro, look. 
They've got water fountains here. That was I saw that in Minecraft. We've got this little tunnel here as well. And I just accidentally teleported into some place. Yeah. Oh my goodness. This is 100% a festival. Oh, what is that? Globus something. So yeah, this is like a... This is a festival or some type of event. I, I don't know. But it's definitely crazy. I mean, look at these. This is epic. Bro, it's got lights in here and everything. Holy smokes. I feel like this place would be just look so insane at night. And it, it does. Oh, here, oh, this is what they look like without the water. Let's see what else we can find around here. Um. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Where was the... Oh, there's the dome. Oh, th here's the big dome, actually. That's to enter. Oh. Oh, and there's like a big old tower or a uh, statue there. A nice uh, arch as well. Let me take a look at Minecraft and see the difference there. Oh my. It's a little bit bigger. The statue is definitely a little bit bigger because, you know, it's Minecraft. You got to do the best you can, but it's the angel. I think it's an angel. That's what it looked like in for the statue. And that's what it looks like here is an angel, golden angel statue. And the arch looks absolutely amazing. What is this? Oh, there's... Water shoots up from here too? Didn't look like it. But here's, yeah, here's this thing. Which you, you enter here. Shopping center. So let me uh, look that up. Oh, holy! Oh! That's insane! The door shut. I don't know why the door's shut, but look at this. Oh, there we go. This place looks insane. Oh my goodness. They make some crazy builds here in Ukraine. They're amazing. Oh my goodness. I, well, obviously this is Minecraft, but the real thing probably just looks absolutely insane. Is this the... Yeah, it is. So you go walk around here, and then here's an elevator. You hop in, you go in here, go into the elevator. Obviously, we can't actually do this, but, you know, if you were to be able to go in here, you can go in the elevator, come out, and now you're on the next floor, which, look how amazing this place looks. I know we got shaders, but it just looks insane. Now, let me go to the thing here and see if we can actually go inside. I want to go inside this thing. Why does it keep taking me to the mall? Maybe that's all they can show me. It's the mall. Oh, there's some random people here. Holy! Holy! This isn't where I wanted to go. But, oh my goodness. This is where you can see it from a distance. And it looks insane. Oh yeah, inside here is a mall too. So, in Minecraft, it was just the map of the place. It was kind of like an easter egg to show the map of the whole place. But in this, it's actually a place to go buy stuff. It's a, it's a mall in there. This whole area is just a giant square mall, I guess. Now, I honestly wonder what these are. These little uh, signs are. Because those weren't there before. And so, my assumption, since it looks like it's a little different for each poster. I mean, I can't read them necessarily, but... Yeah, yeah, I can't read them, but they almost look like maybe it's probably historical facts or something and talking about the whole history of the independence of Ukraine. So that's actually really cool. Let's see if we can actually change this and do something else here. What else can we find here? Holy. Whoa. Wait, are those real people? No way. This place looks insane. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. This place is... Yeah, it's just a big old mall. But look at that. I really like that. That's so cool. All these uh, flowers and... I'm guessing those are mannequins. But I'm not sure. I, I'm really... I can't tell. I'm... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. Okay, those are mannequins. Yeah. I don't know why they would be real people, but I just assumed... That maybe it would be 
real people. I don't know. But, yeah, they're mannequins. I wonder why, though. They have that. Huh. What is this? Oh, this is a close-up. We gotta look at this. This is a close-up of this place. Oh, whatever this is. Oh, it's a hotel. There's a hotel up there, too? Holy moly. There's a trash can right there. Oh, oh! Oh, my goodness! Bro, this is a nice view. Holy moly. You can get some really cool pictures in in this place. My goodness. Yeah, Minecraft looks garbage compared to this stuff. Holy moly. And the fact that, I'm telling you, the fact that they did all these different buildings as well. Like, I don't even know what, what is this? Oh, Potion of Swiftness. Yeah, let's use that. There's actually some things that we didn't see. Holy moly. So, welcome to Ukraine. Uh, Kiev card maiden, whatever that is. I present to you a map of the main square of my hometown, Kiev. This is my first serious project. 1,000 by 150,000. Or 1,500 blocks. Holy moly. This is not an exact copy, but an adapt of a real... Oh. Of a real one, probably. Uh, of the real one. The entire decor and 20% of the buildings are invented and do not correspond to the original. Ah, gotcha. But it said only 20%, though. Most of it is the original. I tried to stick to approximate proportions and scales. Crazy. These are not just copied houses or boxes with holes for windows. As, uh, uh, as in most of... Most cities in Minecraft, each house is individual and made to the details. He took not size, but quality. Yeah, that's definitely good. Origin, uh, originally planned to make the interior of the houses. Some even did. But as a result, he changed his mind over time. Okay. So the the map was built exclusively for exterior famili familiarization with the main square of the capital exterior in addition to the square adjacent streets were built the map itself is surrounded by the forest since kiev is very veg vegetable a green city okay so that's pretty cool it said they took four to seven months creating this and finished by 2018 so th yeah this is a i never said this but this is a old uh build but i mean it's definitely, it definitely deserves a lot of props. 24 years living in Kiev. Wow, that is crazy. Yeah, this guy did a fantastic job. Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. I was thinking, oh, maybe they did, it looks like they didn't finish. Well, actually, this is someone starting to build a new, new building uh, is being created. Which is absolutely insane. We got cranes here. We've got trucks. We've got other vehicles here. We've... Oh, yeah, yeah. Some trucks are taking out the uh, dirt and rubble to make it nice and flat, which is crazy cool. Yeah, this is it. This is 100%. It. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. I wonder if you can go inside. So, let me hop over to Google and show you the, uh, the actual capital. Okay, so this is actually not it. I thought it was the capital, but it's actually a, uh, what is it called? Let me go back. It's called the International Center of Culture and Arts. And apparently, this thing is amazing. I mean, look how huge that is. It's huge. We got beautiful uh, pillars here. We've got looks like some type of recognition of somebody who passed away here and we've got all these nice little shrubs nice greenery definitely really nice man the greenery here is just beautiful man it's not all over the place it's just perfectly set up to look amazing and in minecraft similar to that we've got the shrubs here which is cool we've got the even the trees, wow, even the trees, they took the time to do that. And the amazing pillars, man. It's crazy. 
the amount of detail that they put into this is just absolutely amazing. I highly doubt I'm going to be able to, yeah, I can't actually go in here. So overall, I want to say thank you to this man right here. I don't know the name of him. Um, I'm guessing, oh, wait, 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 there's something right here. There's something right here. Okay, I don't know how to pronounce that, but maybe Sanar, Saner, uh, but this guy right here who created the map apparently alone, which is crazy. He did it all by himself, which is fantastic. So I'm just, this guy is amazing. Definitely amazing. If you want to check out the map yourself, you can in the description. Like I said, this, this video was not geared for me. It wasn't geared necessarily even for this guy, but... All of Ukraine. It was geared for all of Ukraine. And like I said before, if you can and you, you know, you're able to uh, financially donate to the Ukrainian program, be sure to do so in the description. There is a link to the donation. Be able to support the country. And like I said as well, if you can't share the link with some other people who perhaps can afford to do so, definitely feel bad for them. Definitely am praying for the, the country. So that, you know, the, the conflict stops somehow, whether the whether Ukraine wins or, you know, Russia decides to stop being, you know, a jerk to, to say the least, a jerk to Ukraine and, you know, stop the war. Uh, nevertheless, hopefully something happens pretty soon because it's just a mess right now and they need lots of support. They need prayers. They need they need uh, support. Uh, so. Just be, just be thinking, at the very least, you know, if you can't, uh, you know, support them by donation, at the very least, be thinking about them and their situation. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. It wasn't, like I said, it wasn't for me, it was for Ukraine. And have a fantastic day. Stay safe out there, guys.